Section 1. Introduction. The COVID-19 pandemic brought masks into our daily lives, transforming them into a symbol of protection against the virus. Initially, masks were widely accepted as an effective measure to curb the spread of the virus. However, as the pandemic progressed and new variants emerged, the debate surrounding the effectiveness of masks began to shift. This essay aims to explore the evolving understanding of mask effectiveness, particularly after February 2022, and to discuss the future of mask usage in public health strategies. Section 2. Effectiveness of Masks in Early COVID-19 In the early stages of the COVID-19 pandemic, masks were widely recognized as an effective tool for reducing the spread of the virus. Studies conducted during this period provided evidence that masks could significantly decrease the transmission of respiratory droplets, which are the primary mode of COVID-19 transmission. Mask usage, combined with other public health measures such as social distancing and hand hygiene, played a crucial role in slowing down the initial wave of infections. The effectiveness of masks in the early stages of the pandemic was attributed to their ability to block respiratory droplets expelled by infected individuals. Masks act as a physical barrier, preventing these droplets from reaching others and contaminating surfaces. This is particularly important for preventing transmission from asymptomatic or pre-symptomatic individuals, who may be unaware that they are infected and spreading the virus. Furthermore, masks were shown to offer some level of protection to the wearer as well. While the primary function of masks is to reduce outward transmission, they can also filter out some of the virus-laden droplets in the air, reducing the wearer's risk of inhaling them. This two-way protection was instrumental in controlling the spread of COVID-19 during the initial phases of the pandemic. Section 3, The Transition Period Around February 2022, a transition period began where the perceived effectiveness of masks started to shift. This was influenced by several factors, including the emergence of new COVID-19 variants, changes in public health policies, and growing public fatigue with mask mandates. The Omicron variant, in particular, posed a new challenge due to its increased transmissibility. Debates arose regarding whether masks, particularly cloth masks, provided sufficient protection against this highly contagious variant. The shift in perceived effectiveness was partly fueled by evolving scientific understanding of the Omicron variant. Early studies suggested that Omicron might be more capable of bypassing the protection offered by cloth masks, leading to calls for the adoption of more effective mask types like surgical masks or N95 respirators. This led to confusion and uncertainty among the public, as recommendations regarding mask usage became more complex and varied depending on the specific context. Moreover, this period saw a relaxation of mask mandates in several regions, further contributing to the shifting perception of mask effectiveness. As mandates were lifted, people began to question the necessity of masks, particularly in settings where they were no longer legally required. This relaxation of mask wearing policies, coupled with pandemic fatigue, led to a decline in mask usage in many areas. Section 4, Omicron's Impact The emergence of the Omicron variant had a significant impact on the mask debate. Omicron's high transmissibility raised concerns about the effectiveness of cloth masks, which had been widely used during earlier stages of the pandemic. Studies indicated that Omicron might be more capable of penetrating the looser weave of cloth masks, leading to a greater emphasis on the use of more effective masks like surgical masks or N95 respirators. The increased transmissibility of Omicron also highlighted the importance of proper mask fit and adherence to mask wearing guidelines. Even with more effective masks, improper fit or inconsistent usage could compromise their effectiveness. This led to renewed emphasis on public health messaging regarding the importance of wearing masks correctly, covering both the nose and mouth, and ensuring a snug fit. Omicron's impact on the mask debate underscores the dynamic nature of the pandemic and the need for adaptable public health strategies. As new variants emerge, recommendations regarding mask usage may need to be revised to ensure optimal protection. This highlights the importance of staying informed about the latest scientific evidence and public health guidance. In the period after February 2022, we witnessed significant changes in mask mandates globally. Many countries and regions that had previously implemented strict mask mandates 
began to relax or completely lift these requirements. This shift in policy was driven by various factors, including declining case numbers, increasing vaccination rates, and growing public fatigue with mask wearing. Consequently, the relaxation of mask mandates led to a decline in mask usage in many areas. While some individuals continued to wear masks voluntarily, many others opted to forgo masks in settings where they were no longer mandatory. This resulted in a mixed landscape of mask wearing practices with varying levels of adherence to mask recommendations depending on individual preferences, local regulations, and perceived risk levels. The changing mask mandates also sparked debates about the role of personal responsibility versus government regulations in public health measures. Some argued that individuals should have the freedom to choose whether or not to wear masks based on their own risk assessment, while others advocated for continued mask mandates to protect vulnerable populations and prevent future surges in cases. Public perception of masks underwent a noticeable shift after February 2022. The initial widespread acceptance of masks as a necessary protective measure began to wane as the pandemic progressed and mandates were relaxed. Several factors contributed to this shift in perception, including pandemic fatigue, evolving scientific understanding of mask effectiveness, and changing social norms. Pandemic fatigue played a significant role in the changing public perception of masks. After two years of living with pandemic restrictions, many individuals experienced a sense of exhaustion and were eager to return to pre-pandemic normalcy. This fatigue, coupled with the relaxation of mask mandates, led some to view masks as an unnecessary burden rather than a vital protective measure. Furthermore, the evolving scientific understanding of mask effectiveness, particularly in light of new variants like Omicron, contributed to the shift in public perception as debates arose regarding the sufficiency of cloth masks and the need for more effective mask types, some individuals questioned the overall value of masks in preventing transmission. This uncertainty fueled skepticism and reluctance to continue wearing masks. Recent research has provided further insights into the effectiveness of masks in preventing COVID-19 transmission. Studies have confirmed that masks particularly surgical masks and N95 respirators, remain an effective tool for reducing the spread of the virus, including the Omicron variant. However, the effectiveness of masks is highly dependent on proper fit, consistent usage, and the type of mask used. Research has highlighted the importance of mask fit in maximizing their protective benefits. Masks that fit snugly against the face, covering both the nose and mouth, are more effective at blocking respiratory droplets compared to loosely fitted masks. Studies have also demonstrated that N95 respirators offer the highest level of protection, followed by surgical masks, while cloth masks provide the least protection, especially against highly transmissible variants. Moreover, recent research has emphasized the importance of consistent mask usage in reducing transmission. Sporadic or inconsistent mask wearing can significantly compromise their effectiveness, as even brief periods of mask removal can increase the risk of exposure to the virus. This underscores the need for sustained adherence to mask wearing guidelines in high-risk settings. As the COVID-19 pandemic continues to evolve, it is essential to consider the future of mask strategies in public health. Moving forward, mask recommendations should be tailored to the specific epidemiological context taking into account factors such as the prevalence of new variants, vaccination rates, and healthcare capacity. Adaptive mass strategies that respond to changing circumstances will be crucial for maximizing public health protection. One potential future strategy involves promoting the use of more effective masks, such as surgical masks or N95 respirators, in high-risk settings or during periods of heightened transmission. This could involve providing these masks to vulnerable populations or encouraging their use in crowded indoor environments. Public health messaging should emphasize the importance of proper mask fit and consistent usage to ensure optimal effectiveness. Furthermore, future mask strategies should incorporate the lessons learned from the pandemic, recognizing the importance of clear communication, public trust, and flexibility in responding to evolving scientific evidence. Transparent and evidence-based guidance on mask usage tailored to specific contexts will be crucial for gaining public acceptance and ensuring adherence to recommendations.
The mask debate has evolved significantly since the early days of the COVID-19 pandemic. While masks remain an effective tool for reducing transmission, the emergence of new variants, changes in mask mandates, and evolving public perceptions have led to a more nuanced understanding of their role in public health. Moving forward, adaptive mask strategies that respond to changing circumstances and emphasize proper mask usage will be crucial for maximizing protection against COVID-19. Recent research has confirmed the continued effectiveness of masks, particularly surgical masks and N95 respirators, in preventing transmission. However, it is essential to recognize that mask effectiveness is highly dependent on proper fit, consistent usage, and the type of mask used. Public health messaging should prioritize clear communication regarding these factors to ensure optimal adherence to mask recommendations. As we navigate the ongoing pandemic, it is important to stay informed about the latest scientific evidence and public health guidance regarding mask usage. Adaptive mask strategies, tailored to specific contexts and informed by evolving research, will be essential for mitigating the spread of COVID-19 and protecting public health.